السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته. alright so welcome to our math class and today we still gonna practice with the uh, telling time including the minutes. alright so previously we learned about how we can tell the time but only telling the hour right okay let's differentiate between the hour and the minute okay okay so you can see the clock has two hands right okay so we say the small hand tells about the hour and this long hand tells about the minutes all right so the long hand tells about the minute and the small hand tells about the hour okay so previously if the long hand is at number 12 okay is at number 12 right so you're gonna tell the hour by looking at the small hand only right so for example now the small hand is at number one right the small hand is at number one so we can say it's clock one okay so now it's clock one very good because the small hand is at number one okay if we move the small hand to number two so now it is clock two very good all right okay now let's move the small hand to number eight okay so now what time is it okay look at it now what time is it now it's clock eight right very good because the small hand is at number eight the long hand is still at number 12 very good okay so now it's clock eight all right so today we want to practice about the minutes how you can tell the minutes okay one thing that you need to remember is that okay when we want to tell about the minutes okay when we want to tell about the minutes we will go by five right so we're gonna count by five okay remember okay so this is the long hand right this is the minute hand this is the long hand the minute hand is this one all right okay one is at 12 means it's at number zero zero it's o'clock okay o'clock okay so when it's at number 12 you always mention the number of the small hand okay so like now it was Okay, now it is clock one okay, it's clock one because the minute is at 12 which means zero zero very good okay so now okay so for the minute we're gonna count by five numbers all right okay we're gonna count by five so starting from here was zero if the long hand goes here it's five Okay, first let's try counting by five so we can remember counting by five. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five, forty, forty-five, fifty, fifty-five, and sixty, which completes the one hour. Alright, so one hour half. 60 minutes one hour have 60 minutes all right so now let's try telling the minutes since the long hand is at number 12 it means zero zero which is o'clock okay now let's try to move this one okay you put this one here Okay, so we move the long hand to number one. Alright, 
my black marker is not working so i'm going to use again the blue marker okay so now it's at number one okay and the small hand was at number one okay so how we can read this one okay so both of them are at number one the clock we, the hour we say it's clock one because the small hand is at number one but it's not one o'clock because the long hand it's moved from 12 to 5 right so how we can do this one we're gonna look at the black numbers okay so it's clock one okay it's the hour is one still correct but the minute is five because we are moving by five right very good okay now let's try one more time okay this is the Okay. Now the minute move to number two, right? Now the minute move to number two, but the hour is still at number one, right? Very good. So it's still clock one. It's still clock one, right? It's still clock one. But how many minutes? I'm gonna count, right? Zero, five, ten. So now it's at ten minutes, right? So it's one. 10 minutes very good it's clock one and 10 minutes very good okay now we move it here okay now we move it here did the clock move no right it's still clock one it's still clock one right so it's still clock one we're gonna say clock one okay how about the long hand the minute hand it does move so how are we gonna call it five ten now it's at here 15 very good so we're gonna say it's clock one 15 minutes right very good okay now we're gonna move it to number four okay remember what are we moving it's only the minute hand it's not the hour hand okay so our hour still is clock one Okay, still clock one but how many minutes okay we're gonna count again five ten fifteen twenty very good so it's now clock one and twenty minutes clock one and twenty minutes all right okay let's move it again to number five okay number five all right okay the clock moves not yet okay in the actual clock sometimes it moves a little bit this way but it doesn't go to number two yet so what is it it's still at number one okay so it's still at number one the clock we're gonna read is still it's clock one the hour is still one it's one and the minute yes it's moved to number five now so what number is it 25 okay you can count again if you want 5 10 15 20 25 so now it's clock 1 25 minute very good okay now we're gonna move it again okay to number six okay what time what time is it now what is the hour does the hour become six no very good the hour is the small hand it's still at number one so we can still say it's clock one but yes the minute hand the long hand has changed so how we can read this one okay we're gonna look at which number it is number 30 so it is clock one 30 minute clock one 30 minute clock one 30 minute okay let's move again okay let's move it again to number seven all right do the hour hand change no right it's still at clock one so we're gonna still say it's clock it's clock one clock one but yes the minute the minute hand is changed 
and it came to number seven. So how we can read? We can count 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. So it's clock 1, 35 minute. Very good. So now it's clock 1, 35 minute. All right. Okay. Let's move it again to number 8. Okay. So we have the long hand, the minute hand moved to number 8. How about the small hand, the hour hand? It's still at number 1, right? So we're still going to say it's clock 1. Okay. How many minutes? We can, if you want, we can still count. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. So now it's clock 1 and 40 minutes. It's clock 1 and 40 minutes. Very good. Okay, now we move it again. Okay, we move it again to number 9. All right. Okay. Do we move the small hand? No, right? The small hand is still at number 1. So our clock, our hour is still clock 1. Right. Clock 1, but the minute hand moved. To which number? 45, right? Before it was 40, we add 5. 45, very good. So now it's clock 1. Clock 1, 45 minutes. Very good. Okay. We're going to change it again. Move it to number 10. Okay. Our hour is still 1. Very good. Our hour is still clock 1. Okay. How about our minute? Now it's clock. It's, uh, sorry, what minute is this? 50 minutes. So now it's clock 1. 50 minutes. Very good. Now it's clock 1. 50 minutes. Right, we're going to move it again. All right. Okay. Now, has this one changed? Not yet. It's still clock one, right? So, it's still clock one. Our hour is still one. Our minute is 55. So, if you don't know what number it should be here, you're going to still count from here. Five. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, and lastly, 55, right? So it's clock 1, 55, very good. Okay, now, this one we're going to move here, and this one is going to move here. Yeah. So now what clock is it? What clock is it? Is it, still, is it still clock one? No, the hour moved to number two, right? So now it's clock two. And this one came at the 60 minute or the zero zero. So it's the beginning of a next hour. Okay, we completed one hour, right? And now we came to the second hour. Okay, so now it's clock 2 o'clock, right? Very good. Okay, so I want you to practice with number 3 and number 4. Okay, try to write it in your book or draw it in your book or take a clock, okay? Move the hands, move the hands along, okay? You start by moving only the minutes, okay? Move only the minutes first and try to count. So each one you count by 5, okay? So today it's counting by Five. The minutes is counting by five. All right. Very good. So I hope you enjoyed this video again. Okay. And I'm going to give you another worksheet to practice more. I know this topic is going to be a little bit difficult. So we're going to practice again and again until we master it. All right. Thank you so much. And I'm going to see you again. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.